Hi everybody, it's Beth. I'm getting ready to do my Dollar Tree haul. Boy, my schedules with my grandson Hunter just haven't met up and I went to the Dollar Tree, um, gosh, several days ago. So I really got to get the stuff hauled and wanted you all to see it. And then, um, look what they came out with online today. Are you kidding me? Oh my goodness. I totally just got done telling you all how much I love Paisley and they do this to me. I'm going to have to get me some of those. So, hey, be back here in just a minute with my Dollar Tree haul. Peace. Okay, guys, here we go with my haul. A few things I want to mention real quickly. First, I've got a cold. I'm going to the doctor this afternoon. This afternoon, sore throat. Oh, my gosh. My husband was sick for a week. We haven't been sick all winter and now it's finally starting to get kind of nice out and here we go. So I um, wanted to mention that and um, also too, well you can't see it, but I noticed that in a lot of my videos I'm wearing all my um, Cleveland sports team shirts. So yeah, I just wanted to say gotta represent, love all my Cleveland sports teams and you know, see, uh, go Cavs, maybe we can make it back to the finals this year and bring us home a win. So I wanted to get that out of the way and I got a big haul for you here. I'm so sad that I had I couldn't wait for Hunter anymore because I just, this stuff's laying around. I need to get it hauled and get it put away. Um, and there's a lot of things I'm working on that I'm using stuff for. So I want to get that done. Um, so yeah, okay, here I go. Um, no particular order and Things are going to be, you know, a little here and there, but we're a quick bag of uh, some of the regular food items, food products that we buy. It's just the uh, pork skins, barbecue, and regular. I got two of each. Actually, I think I got three of each, but I don't know. So that's that. They had some new stickers. They had some new washi stuff I was really excited about. These are new to me, but very cute nonetheless. These little Puffy Owl collection. Oh, the glare. Oh my gosh. Okay, let's... What am I going to do? These puffy animals pop up. And... Now I'm going to stop this for a minute and see what I can do about glare. Okay, so I did the hokey pokey and I turned myself around and now I'm glowing. Oh. <laughs> Hopefully it'll solve the glare. Yeah, I don't know if I'll ever find a good place to videotape. So I'm going to keep going here. So yeah, I just got done talking about how much I like Paisley. And then they had to come out with those Paisley plates that you can only buy online and you can only buy 24 at a time. Ridiculous. I don't want 24. I don't need 24. Hey, uh, anybody has a solution out there? I don't know. But because I don't think I'm going to run to the Dollar Tree every single day since they come, you know, from the time they come out to see if they've gotten into the store yet. So I don't know. Maybe I'll just get lucky and find some. But, um,. So the whole, but the whole point is they also had this Paisley tote bag. So I picked that up. I figured if you watched my um, sticker binder video or whatever, I could, I could put my sticker binders in here and tote them along easily. So yeah, that was really cute. Perfect. I get a whole bunch of stuff here, guys. I found these little tiny Easter eggs. I'm gonna make those um, Easter topiaries. So these will likely come in handy for that. Then I got 
these medium sized Easter eggs that I'm thinking about doing um, the twine wrap or the um, jute wrap. So, yeah, I got some different size eggs for that. So, more than likely, not these, but this one, this we hauled in a previous haul, it's just candy. This one, and then I got a great big one today. This one. If you watch the Purse Divas Major Target Haul, Mega Target Haul, she hauled these really cute Easter eggs that were wrapped with jute. So I have jute, and I bought some, actually some polyester string in the automotive section of the Dollar Tree that came in the colors. It'll, it'll be coming up here in the hall. And I'm going to try to wrap these, some glue and some jute, and see how they turn out. So I've got the different sizes, this size and this size, and I'd like to find something in between. I may already have something in between. I think I probably do, because I think I have some like this, only a little bit bigger than I hauled before. So that's what that's all about. And then I am so into all the... Oh, no, these aren't the... I, I was thinking they were the growing things, but these are the stretchy things. So there's stretchy frogs. And you can just pull them and stretch them. So I got each of the kids those for their Easter baskets. I got four of those. Some of the different mosses to do the topiaries that I talked about. I'm actually going to make some of the bigger topiaries. And you know what? I will put the picture in here of the one that the Purse Diva hauled from Target Dollar Spa or Target uh, it's not Dollar Spot. It's that other section. I don't know. I'm not familiar with it. So, um, anyway, I'll try to stick a picture up here so you can see what I'm talking about. So, I got some of the candlesticks from the Dollar Tree. There's two different ones. You see, this one is that this one's round and this one is octagonal <laughs> I think it's octagon I don't know if that's an octagon I think an octagon has eight sides but anyway it's uh two different um candlesticks and I've got the styrofoam balls They're about this big around I plan to cover those in the moss and then put the cute little eggs all over it I'm going to add some um, metallic paint to sort of speckle, speckle the eggs kind of, and put those on there. So yeah, that should be a fun project. So I got, uh, I plan to make five or four or five of these, three. yeah, five of these for the different women in the family and, um, That'll be part of their treasure that they get at the treasure hunt. If I get around to getting it done, because we're having the treasure hunt, but I don't know if I can get all these projects done by then. So I got that. I found these cute little spring wrapping papers, and I thought they were really pretty, so I picked those up. Really cute. Working uh, scrapbooks, planners, paper pad projects, um, pocket folder envelope thingies that I do. Well, that I just did my first one of. Really enjoyed that. So I thought that was really cute. Floral paper, pretty colors. So I picked those up. And here we go with some stickers add these stickers to my sticker collection so much fun they have stickers with googly eyes so cute googly eye stickers these are the monsters these are the dinosaurs they'll come in handy with the scrapbooks i talked about doing for the kids and the sea creatures
And that's all the googly eye stickers. And then I got, I think these ones are even kind of last year or something, but I never had any of them, so I picked them up. The citrus, very cute. Ooh, these are cute. Little kind of slightly puffy little mushrooms. Mushrooms is one of my favorite things, raw mushrooms to eat. I like them cooked as well. Don't like them on my pizza very much, but um, I like them with, you know, a steak with some onions and mushrooms, or I love them raw in my salads. And in fact, I just eat them raw for breakfast, lunch, and dinner. But anyway, here's some of the flower stickers that are, that have like the foil accents, shiny foil. There's several of these different variety. So cute. And then some more of these type. Not sure if I got this set the last time. So uh, I went ahead and picked up this one because I did buy several of the ones like these. But um, I don't think I had this one, so I picked that up. And then I hadn't seen these. So cute because I do love birds. So here's the birds ones. Awesome. We like feeding the birds in our bird feeder and watching the birds. And I have a book and like to look them up and see what new kind of birds we get around here. Last year we had... Um, some birds show up, and I think they were gross beaks, and they're just, wow, amazing and beautiful. They have red, and they're big, and we have all kinds of um, woodpeckers like that with the black and white stripes and red and all that, but anyway, yeah, we like the birds, and then there's, these were really cute. I've seen these ones hauled before, but they've got the banner and the little blimp or zeppelin, very vintage looking, adorable. Says lovely and love you. So cute. And then I picked up these. The rainbow pop up little polka dot stickers. And I picked up a couple decks of playing gar cards because I saw, well, first of all, we like to play cards and we can never have enough decks. And second of all, I saw them being used in the pocket letters and stuff and you put your tape on them and you you decorate them up and so cute so really cute design to do that or great use for them as well so there's those and then i got some extra packs of two-sided tape i am currently working on the tissue paper wedding dress and you know slowly but surely it might not be for this year's contest, and hopefully they continue to have the contest. So maybe um, even if I don't get it done and get it en um, entered for this year, maybe it'll be in progress for next year. Okay, so I picked up some of the deco tape. I hadn't picked any of that up before, so I got a couple different varieties of that. These are the metallic ones. And the blue, green, and pink. And these are the glitter ones. And the pink, purple, and green. Very cute. Finding some more stickers here. More googly eye stickers. Adorable. Oops, I kind of got these ones smashed up. Little puppies. Oh my goodness, those are too cute puppy stickers. I found these little puppy ones with the animals. Oh, I think I already showed this. Oh, did I get two of those? I don't even know. I don't think so. Oh, yeah, I did get two of those. Oh, well. Put that over there. All right, I picked up two packs of the um, egg coloring kits. All right, this one says shake an egg, so I'm not sure. But anyway, I got that one. And I don't know where the other one is. I'll come across it here in a minute. 
And then I found these cute little watering cans. I thought, what fun for the kids to play with, play in the sand or whatever. Just really cute. So I picked a couple of those up. We'll figure out how to use them. I picked up four of these hopping toys. Two of these, um, I don't know, is this supposed to be a rabbit? It looks like a, <laughs> it looks like a rabbit chick. But anyway, two of the rabbits and two of the chicks to put in their Easter baskets. Very cute. Oh, another set deck of playing cards. I like the pattern on that one. And um, they had a couple of different new uh, duct tapes at my store this time. Duct tapes that I hadn't seen or purchased before. So I went ahead and picked those up. And one is this giraffe looking type. I thought that was awesome. And then this decorative design with the bright fuchsia and um, golden yellow. And this is for the dress project, clear tape. And then there's this one with all the little glasses all over it. How cute is that? Little eyeglasses all over the tape. I like the colors too. Very cute. And I picked up some of the glass beads. I love these and the minty green color. Ooh, this set right here, this package has like, oh my gosh, they, look how pretty they are. They have, I don't know if you can tell, it's, it's iridescent almost. It looks, they look purple and blue and green. So pretty. It's hard to tell on camera. And I am using this in the wedding dress. Just this, not these. But sadly, in order to get this stuff, which I love the fabrication that I'm doing with it, I had to buy several of these. So that's okay. We'll use them with the kids and play and crafting and scrapbooking and stuff. So that. And then I've seen these several times, but never picked them up. And you know what? I decided since I am making the scrapbook for the kids and actually one of them, um, I'm going to do a comic book type theme, at least on the cover of it, make it kind of look like a comic book so forth. And so, um, I picked up the Avenger tape. And I picked up the Ninja Turtle tape. And this is the jute and the polyester, actually, string I was talking about to wrap the eggs. Even though it's polyester, I thought it would still look cute. Hopefully I can get it to stick. I think I'll definitely have to use um, hot glue to get this to stick onto the egg, but how cute. I might even mix them, I don't know. And then I got one of the Ivy Twig Garland that I saw really cute. They took um, the watering can and they put the Ivy Twig garland around like the handle and stuck some flowers and different things in there as a centerpiece or you know table decoration or whatever so I picked one of those up to have on hand and they had they haven't had any washi tape for a long time and this time they did so I picked up several washies. I don't know if I can find them here for you. All right, and 
I'm happy about this. These might be old washies that people already have, but I don't have them. So I picked them up and now I can put them in my Pringles can washi container that I made. And I, I am excited about that and I love using it and I'm going to make some more. So, but yeah, this is really cute. I love old keys. And so they had the old keys on the washi tape. So I got that. A red and white stripe, just, you know, general kind of thing to have. They've had this one in the store during the whole Easter process. And this time I finally did pick it up with the little chicks on it. And this one is like birthday hats, celebratory um, gar um, confetti and stuff. So I got that one. And then this one is just a really nice stripe pattern design. Very cute. And that's all that's right here in front of me at the moment. Oh, yeah, there, I found some more hair. Um, I thought this was really cute. It's almost denim-like, which I really like denim things. And uh, cloud-like, denim-like, I don't know. To me, that's what it reminds me of, clouds and, and denim. Who wouldn't like a denim cloud? Yay! <laughs> so, I, I got that one. I'm going to show you again because I like it so much. Very cute. Oh, and then this one's got little owls all over it. Adorable. So I was excited to find just big old row of hanging washi tape at my store. Oh yeah, and this one is the cool um, stamp, kind of stamp-like theme. Um, I want to say aviation style, but... It really isn't. It's all more like, more about stamps in early America. But, I mean, that's the vibe I get from it. So I got some of that. That's really cute. And then they had the green leaf one. I got that. And I think that might be, oh, here's another one. Oh, very cute. Gray, um, two tones of gray and yellow polka dots with a white background. Really nice. I like that one. So, yeah, I was really excited. They had a whole bunch of that washi at my store, and so I picked it up. I saw people hauling this, and I used floss. I used the little picks mostly, but these were so cute. So, And I love fish, too. There, now you have it. You know all the things I love. I love fish for decorative purposes and stuff. I, I like to eat fish too, but that's not the point. I like wooden fish that hang on walls and decorative fish and stuff like that. And fish stickers and I like horses. Same kind of thing. I love real horses too. We have some. They're not ours, but our neighbor's horses. And they're out here in the field beside our house all the time. And they're just gorgeous. But anyway, and I love paisley and um, the old keys. I collect finials. So yeah, if you don't know what finials are look it up um but anyway yeah so i had to pick up this floss because it has the fish design i got i don't know three or four packs of glue to go with my glue gun that i hauled from the goodwill the other day i showed you all and then i went ahead and got the um the baker's twine too wrap an egg with that would be really cute Mostly for the orange and the yellow. And these I had never seen before. And I like to just have stuff around the house here for the little ones to play with. So I picked up these little wooden puzzles, real wood. And it's so cute. Easy to do puzzles. So the little train. And the emergency vehicle which is awesome. And I might give them to Morgan to keep up at her house for toys. Um, she's an, a volunteer EMT and a firefighter, so she will appreciate this one. And then this one's just like a little house. I thought those were really cute. Keep around here for the little ones before they get too big. 
And I picked up this tic-tac-toe game. I thought that was fun. Um, yeah, you spin it. I win. <laughs> and then I got two of the cute little fly swatters. This one's a leopard print for Morgan to take up to her house. Thought it was adorable. And then the little froggy. Yeah. I had to pick up a couple of the 3D paper clips. I know that people have hauled these already before, but I went ahead and got them because instead of using a clothespin on my sticker binders, I could use these. And of course, you can use them. To, I can use them to mark pages in my Bible. Um, different things. So, there's that. Oh, I've, I picked up some vinyl letters. Three sheets. Actual size and style, two inches. And then on the back, it tells you, you know, you get two A's. You know, two of these, one of these, whatever. So I picked up two packs of those. Show you closer so you can see what they are. And then I got some of these over the door um, hooks. The blue ones and the white ones. And just a couple more bags here. I picked up some more of the lanterns. Because we all want them for outdoor decorating this summer. And Morgan's new back porch is so cool. We can't wait to decorate it. I saw people haul these and say how they, they're just napkins. They're a cute spring design called Spring Fling. And I found these in the section, you know, they weren't like with all the other, they weren't with the Easter decor and they weren't with all the other paper plates and stuff. They were around the corner like, I don't know, weird, like by, um... By the fruit, you know, the, the, the fake fruit and the, some of the floral decorating kind of stuff, I guess. I don't know. But anyway, I saw someone haul these and say that they use them in their bathroom for guest towels. And I think that's a really great idea. In fact, my sister used to do that too. Um, whenever she was having to get together or something, she used real cloth ones. But anyway, um, she would lay out several different towels in the bathroom. So each person kind of had their you know, use their own towel and then toss it in the little laundry basket thing. But anyway, I thought that was a really cute idea. We're having an Easter gathering coming up soon, so I will open these up and place them in the bathroom for people to use to dry their hands. Oh, here's the other egg coloring kit. This one says speckled. Cute. I had to pick up some of these multi-purpose clips in the multi-color pack. Green, purple, orange, blue, red, and black. Awesome. I found a box of sun-made raisins. So I got those. I don't eat a lot of raisins. Raisins um, affect my blood sugar adversely pretty badly so I don't need a lot of them but I can have them occasionally and I've forgotten now there's something I like to throw them in where I just get a few and uh, I guess it's when I take some of the things that are less carbs and I mix them all together and kind of make my own trail mix so I can throw in a few raisins and some dark chocolate chips and a few things like that and it's not too bad I can have a little bit of that for us for a fun snack. All right, yeah, more of the glass beads. These are so awesome. I got the black and white. 
And again, they are iridescent looking. So they're not only black and white, but they do have the look of iridescence. And then I got the gold ones. So cool. Great for shaker cards, obviously for sewing. Can't use these on the paper, toilet paper wedding dress, but it would be really great, you know, to add decorative touches to things that you sew. Oh, and then I got some of this glitter glue. And it's got the two different pink tones and the silver. And wow, you know, I think that's it. That's the end of my haul, guys. I know it was pretty major. I've got quite a bit of stuff here. Wish I could have shared it with Hunter, but we'll go again and do that the next time. So, yep, everything is good. I hope you're all well. And thank you so much for watching. And I'm, I'm gaining followers, and I really appreciate that. I'm having so much fun doing this. And um, so please keep watching. Please comment below. I'm just looking forward to those comments. Um, I try to reply to each and every one of them. So, yeah. All right, everybody. See you soon in my next video. Peace.